old center where I have the privilege of having my office is a magical place for me. You ask any center alum, any longtime faculty member here, what's the face of Center College? It's got to be old center. People who know Center College, people who have attended Center College, when they see that image, they know exactly what it is. It represents Center College. Well, you know, Old Center has become the icon. It was uh, initially everything. The, the, um, as you walked in the door, on the left and the right were two rooms where the literary and debating societies met. Old Center uh, housed faculty, it housed students. It's where they ate, it's where they went to class, it's where uh, the first library was. Gradually, of course, uh, the college added buildings to the campus, but uh, even through the end of the 19th century, uh, Old Center was the main building on the campus. I love the fact that the original architects decided to uh, make a, a Doric feeling to it. You know, Doric as opposed to Ionic or Corinthian is solid and it's going to last forever. It's continuous, it's stable, it's strong. There's never a time I don't go through the front door that I don't stop for a moment or more often come out the front door and, and realize uh, Old Center's hallowed ground. Uh, everybody who has been a part of the Center College story, I think has a part of his or her identity in that building. Um, and so for me, Old Center is a magical place to work. Uh, it is rich in history. Its impact in the American educational experience is profound, and it will become more so over time. The fact that we have retained it as a kind of a central place in the life of the institution, that's not true at many places where you would go. The campus has moved, the campus uh, center has shifted. In the case of Center College, Old Center has remained both physically and I think symbolically as, as sort of the place where we started and the place where we still are. Now, what many people today don't know is that when Old Center opened up, it didn't look much like it looks today. There was no front portico, uh, no columns. Um, there were no wings. Where the current president's office is and the current dean's office is, those ends of the building weren't there. It was just a two-story brick building, very plain, what we would call federal style of architecture today. The building has served Center in, in, in so many different ways, as a classroom, as laboratories, as a, a residence hall. It was called the Center Home at one point. During the Civil War, of course, uh, most people know this, but they don't think a lot about what it means. It was commandeered by the Confederate Army as a hospital, a surgery, and then by the Union Army. I look at it kind of as an incubator as well. You know, a lot of other institutions started at All Center. EKU started at All Center. The Presbyterian Seminary started at All Center. Uh, the law school at U of L started at All Center. And so, in the past almost 200 years now, it, it's given birth to not only Center College, but lots of offshoots. When I think about Old Center, I'm not many days thinking about the history that was made in the past there. I'm thinking about the history that we are making now.